the genius of our country is the Big Ten and that we include folks of all kinds from all over the world who come here and become Americans. And that great thing about our country is the great thing about our party. I walk into Democratic Party meetings all over this country and any meeting I walk in, you're going to find somebody just like you. I'm an optimist and I think most Democrats are optimists. We think we can make a difference, that there is a role for everyone in our country. I think about John F. Kennedy. It was through his vision and galvanizing America into believing that we could put a man on the moon. The very first thing that I was excited about was the Lilly Ledbetter Act um, because it's fair pay for women. Legislations um, that help the Latino community, a lot of them are brought about by the Democrats. We are the party that has given our nation civil rights. We fought for equal rights, women's rights. I've been struck from an early age about the challenge of living in the greatest and wealthiest nation in the history of the world with so many people who don't have health insurance coverage. I think the president just went out there and said, we're going to establish the principle in this country that your ability to get treatment for illness or sickness shouldn't depend on your wealth. No one should have to skip going to college because they can't afford it. Everyone who wants that opportunity should be able to seize it. So making college and grad school more affordable um, that's something we've needed to do for a long time, and I'm glad we finally have accomplished that. I think President Obama's uh, greatest accomplishment uh, is really saving uh, the economic system in America. It is the Democratic Party that stands up uh, for the LGBT Americans. It was the youth and their powers to sway the electorate that made a huge difference in the 2008 election. I did the phone bangs, I did the precinct captain, I did everything I could for President Obama. And uh, when he won, it was just incredible. You know, that not only did I live to see, you know, the first African-American president, but I also helped him get elected. People will have health care um, because I knocked on doors and, <laughs> and made phone calls along with my team to help get the health care bill passed. So for me, that it, it's, it's life changing. I don't look at it as politics at all. I look at it as, as changing lives. If we want to continue to see President Obama pushing legislation and see our Congress passing meaningful legislation for the American people, then we need to be electing strong local allies of the President. I never really planned to run for elected office myself until the opportunity came. And I looked around and I said, if I want to make a difference in my community, why not run? I do believe what the Bible says, that I am my brother's keeper. I do want to help and make a difference for just the everyday American. Um, I want everybody to feel like they're included and that we can have a better future if we all work together. There needs to be a political movement, a party, that talks about the future and talks about a way, ways to make every community better and to make the lives of the citizens of that nation better, that thinks about what needs to be done to keep our nation great and to make it even greater. And to make it greater not just for its institutions, but more importantly for its people. We have been that party that makes this nation great because of its people. You should have the same opportunities as an American to pursue that American dream. It's your dream. As cliche as it sounds, the sky is the limit for anybody. Thanks to Democrats and thanks to Obama, uh, you know, anybody can make it. Anybody can, can achieve their goals. It's just up to you.